fuck. That's I your just spider appeared. climb. That's your spider climb work. Not appeared. Thing. You've noticed it. Yeah, sorry. I just yeah, what, what, like a line has just like. Am I just? So we're assuming that, that it, oh my God, it parts in the middle. Like a grid has just appeared. Yes. No, the grid's okay. always been there. The grid's always been there, but I think it's been faded away enough that you've, you haven't seen it. That was why I made the hexes a bit. I thought yeah, it had the. This so thing. It's working. It's working. My, my Everyone op- stop. Everyone stop. Um. I need to find. I need to find where this is connected to. How how would I go about doing that? Um, so that that would. What do you mean connected to? Oh, like what? <laughs> like uh, what 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 triggers this? Is this in any way? Um, that would be investigation for sure. Okay. But you'd have Can to. Step closer. Yeah, because like you can't. There might be the, the the mechanism might be underneath it, right? You you're not. There's no guarantee you can. Finder or mech. mech. Um, all right, let's see. Investigation. Yeah, so you can see again, the seam actually travels all, all the way around. So there are like two plates on either side which which will, will fall inwards. Um, but you don't know what would cause it. There's no, there's no obvious pressure plates um, around this front section. So it's not like someone. There's no pressure plates in the middle section either. They're really just solid, solid slabs of, of worked stone. What does the door on the other side look like? Uh, I actually, because it could be that we misuse the door and the next door, and therefore yeah. we all fall in. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Um, another slab blocks the hallway twenty feet beyond the first door. An iron lever is set into the door's surface with a graven stone skull leering down from above. So there's a lever. Okay. So that's how we activate the floor. If, if you pull the lever, that could cont- potentially open the floor. Maybe that's what the lever's for. That's, that's all your investigation can tell you, really. There's no other contraptions that you can see. Oh, so, I can reach it with Mage Hand. What is the formation you chose? Sorry. So, well, uh, should we get into the formation so that Kim can at least know? So, yeah, yeah. yeah. Time, on, time Kim. out. Show me your formation first, and then I, because, because, yeah, it's it's, it's, it's a pain for me to move the NPCs. Yeah. yeah so, so, the agreed formation was Tilly was up front with a ten foot pole given to her by Owen. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so Tilly has a ten foot pole and the batting ram. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Bloody hell, that's overcompensating. <laughs> hey. uh, Who's next? May, May is behind Tilly. You can, okay. you can demonstrate here. Yeah, demonstrate in general, here. fine, but I, I think more Tilly and yeah, yeah, please, May please just move each other. The okay. point was just so May doesn't get killed from something that hits. Okay, you, you would be moving yeah. into the, the actual aura here, yeah. guys. You, you can see on. over Tilly anyway, so. Um, yeah, she's short, so just stand behind her. Fine, fine, fine. Okay, okay. Arrange yourselves around Dragon Bay. Yeah. <laughs> so stick Tilly there, I guess. I guess. On that hex, I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put Tilly on that hex. Yeah. Okay, this is this is good so far. Um, maybe, CL, where are you CL, in this formation? CL maybe come like either in the middle or a bit closer, because she needs to be able to see magic as well. Yes, I think she should be further in the front, because she does have range. Like beside me. She's also instance. tough. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's a good place, I think. Yeah, and Owen, you can probably still go there without any issues. Um, Uh, I think we agreed artists to go in the back. An artist next to me here. You got Andre here. Let's get all Vex a bit further up. Maybe if Uh, all Vex goes there, and then Andre can go on like the side or like behind it. Yeah, like yeah. Have, we need someone. We just need someone with relatively. Decent... Should we have artists on on vanguard yeah. uh, on rear guard? Yeah, I, need, yeah, I think we just need someone with relatively decent perception. Okay. okay, so I'll assume this. Really? Yeah. Okay. Uh, 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 so you can go how you were before while you're investigating. Okay. Um, Carmen. Um, <laughs> I feel like it's a bit obvious. But there's a lever on that door, and well, uh, do you see? Do you see this floor? No, do, yeah. you, do you see this floor? It's it no. will open. I have a feeling that we fuck up whatever just to do with that door. That okay. door is gonna that trap door is gonna open, and it's gonna be a lot of trouble down there, possibly death. So, either we try the lever and see if it triggers the door, or we maybe it opens the door. My concern is that what pull the lever. Open the trap door, and we can't recall. We can't close the trap door. Are we all just gonna? 
Like we can find a way across. Obviously, yeah. you've got spider climb. Great. Um, Owen, Owen. I can jump across. As I can jump. But Owen can thingy. We'll we'll I find a way across. Okay. Okay. Sure. Sure. In which case, I think since we've done this before, in the past, with the stupid island, what do you call it? The yeah. Shall I? Oh, hold, hold up a moment, uh, friends. Artist, artist calls out. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, artist. And he, he he walks up. You know, he's he's rummaging around his backpack, and he takes out these iron spikes that he's got. Um, and he starts uh going uh like to the side here, like the side of the doors of, of where this door slid up into the ceiling. Um, and he, he calls Dragon Bait over, who gives him like a leg up. And then he starts hammering the iron spikes right into the top um, the, of the stone. So there are, like, spikes now s sticking out. Oh, uh, to stop the door from going back down. So yeah, yeah, the, so he the says, you know, there, shall we? This, is, this is, uh, you know, old, you know, old school adventuring. Just, just make sure we put these everywhere. Uh, it looks like pretty heavy doors. Use four spikes. Should okay. Does anybody else have have those? Put the rod there. Yeah, yeah. You can get rid of the rod. Let's see. Do, what what sort of pack has those spikes? Because uh, uh, I've got I've got uh, some too. I've got some. So you I've have got... iron spikes. I should do if I've got the dungeoneering pack. Well, uh, we we don't know if the dungeoneering pack has iron spikes. That was just Rowan's conjecture. Okay, hold on. I am very wise, Kim. I, could, I should go I could, by I could, my I could, <laughs> one I remember seeing. <laughs> Uh, yeah. So I think kittens, kittens can can work I have ten in a pinch. Kittens. In Fish. a pinch, yeah. I don't think I don't know if they're, I don't think they're the same as iron spikes, but I don't actually know the difference. So. I'm googling pitten. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Google that. Because the metal has spike ten is pitons. driven into the crack or a seam. It's part of climbing equipment, so yeah. it is. It's used so you can attach the rope to it, right? Because there's like literally a uh, like a a hole through it. Um, uh, okay. It would act the same way as a as um. You would, yeah. You would shove it into the rock in the same way, at least. Um. I think. Okay. Um. All right. Well. Uh, yeah. yeah. Iron spike is apparently not a dungeon. 